father was a, a partner way back in the day with another gentleman, Nathan Fine. And uh, then when they passed, I bought the business out from uh, my father's partner at that time. Um, well, I'm here since I was a boy working from about 13 years old on and off. And I'm working here um, full time for about 30 years. So it's been quite a while, yeah. So I've seen lots of uh, changes in the area here. The work clothing is a, is a specialized business, and you really can't find this stuff in that many stores. So it it lends itself to be uh, successful because of out of need. But I went to Porridgeman High School, so I used to go to high school, and I would walk here after school and work after school as a, as a teenager. And... Uh, the area at that time was, that was in the early 70s. So the area was just starting to change a bit. The mall had just opened up. Some of the businesses were moving away, going to the mall or going to the plaza on Forest Avenue. So that's um, kind of how it was. And, but, it, but back in the day, in the 30s, 40s, 50s, and 60s, this was the shopping mecca. And you couldn't even walk down the street because the people were walking both sides of the street. It was a very active, busy area. Well, uh, my father's partner at the time, he was the owner of Paul's Men's Shop, which was up on, which was two blocks up. I remember going to Low Bells and Christmas time with Santa being outside or in the back he was. And I remember Tom McCann, Miles, A.S. Beck, all the shoe stores were here. Archie Jacobson's was here. Um, Melody Ann, I remember Van Roons was very popular with the older women in those days. My mom used to go to Albert's Hosiery to buy stockings back in the day. We, did, we found our niche and actually as the neighborhood changed in the 1990s, it became more of a Mexican neighborhood, poor Richmond. So that really uh, enhanced my business as well because what, are they, what do these gentlemen do? They are landscapers and they're contractors. So uh, their, their needs fit right into what I sell. So they really gave my business a shot in the arm back in the 90s and it progressed up until this day.